بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إنا أنزلناه في ليلة القدر بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إن الحمد لله نحمده ونستعينه ونستهديه ونعوذ بالله من شرور أنفسنا ومن سيئات أعمالنا من يهده الله فلا مدل له ومن يدلل فلا هادي له وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله صلوات الله وسلامه عليه أما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته ما dear listeners, viewers, uh, brothers and sisters of Ghana Muslim Union, I say to you, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, and welcome to this evening's uh, um, uh, little uh, sermon, which is uh, tonight uh, marks uh, the, <coughs> the beginning of the last uh, 10 days of, of uh, this blessed month of Ramadan. We thank Allah that Allah has respite us and give us life, uh, give us uh, strength and then the iman to start this uh, uh, this this uh, glorious glorious month uh, of Ramadan. Uh, we started it, Alhamdulillah, and we get to the middle of it, and now we are going closer to the third uh, part of it, the first 10 days and uh, the middle 10 days, and now we are uh, beginning the, the last uh, 10 days of, of, of the month. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept it to us, to continue to accept it for us, and give us the strength to, to do more uh, uh, in the last day. As the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam used to do, he used to be the best person in Ramadan, especially when the last 10 days come. He said, he said he tied up his belt, meaning he, he, he do more. He, 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 he do more uh, than he, he does within the, the, the beginning of Ramadan. When the last day come, they are the best day of the world this the last 10 days of ramadan they are the best the best day we'll talk uh, uh, about that more now we ask allah to help us to to see the end of this ramadan and to see it with a lot of prayers doing tahajjud doing sadaqahs doing a lot of goods doing a lot of du'a, istighfar, doing tahleel, la ilaha illallah, doing takbir, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, a lot of istighfar we need to do, you know, because these are the best days that one can gain a lot, a lot, a lot of reward of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we ask Allah to save us from the hellfire. And this, uh, the best night that Allah comes down in the night to say, Oh, my servant who will seek for forgiveness and I'll forgive him. So, inshallah, we pray that Allah help us, uh, each and every one of us, to, to have a good, a good, a good ending uh, of this uh, uh, glorious uh, month. Because these ten days are so important that because uh, as uh, the letul Qadr is found within the last ten days of uh, this uh, this month, uh, from now going we will be expecting any odd days uh, of uh, uh, of Laylatul Qadr, and because of the Laylatul Qadr. Uh, these 10 days become the best days in the world and uh, because the Lele Trikadr is within the last 10 days and the reason the Lele Trikadr also become the, the night of power because uh, Allah revealed the Quran 
to the f uh, first heaven in this uh, uh, in this little cutter. And because of Quran being revealed in the night of power, and then within the last day of the month, even though some scholars say uh, in the, the first ten days of Ramadan, but the, the, the majority of scholars agree that it's, it's within the last day, according to the hadith, the, the narration of the Prophet Sallallahu shows that we should expect this night within the last ten days uh, of uh, Ramadan. Uh, and because the Prophet Sallallahu uh, wanted to show his ummah uh, which day it is, and he found the companions were arguing, and Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala took it off his mind, and and, and he couldn't, you know, uh, actually um, pinpoint exactly which day it was, but he did said we should seek it within the odd days of the last 10 days of Ramadan, inshallah. Whatever it is, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is a merciful person. He's a merciful God. Allah is a merciful God. Even though we we expect in it, within the last odd days, the 27th, as they said, from 21st, 25th, uh, 23rd, 25th, the 9th of 25th, the, the 9th of 27th. Or, or the ninth of 20, uh, 29. So, Allah's mercy is encompasses everything. So, that is why these 10 days are so important. You do any good in it, and inshallah, Allah's blessings will reach each and every one uh, of us. So, a lot of things can be done. Doing your tahajjud, doing your tasbih, yeah, yeah. Remembrance Allah Takbir La ilaha illallah La ilaha illallah Subhanallah 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 Also doing a lot of Quran reading That's the, that's the best one A lot of Quran reading Because this is a month of Quran So doing a lot of Quran reading Inshallah Is something that is, is, is much uh, uh, required And then that will stop you Talking You know uh, 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 talking on air, talking communication, conversation that is not is is not proper, because the professor Alisson says, "Man lam yada kaul zur wa amal bi, fa lese lillahi lahu hajatan an yada taamuhu sharabu." You know, for you to be in Ramadan, talking that is not beneficial, it's not nice. Abuse, abusive talk and all that. Prophet Sallallahu said, Allah uh, does not need your you to leave your, your stomach with hunger and your uh, and taste. Uh, you just killing yourself with hunger and taste and your Ramadan will not be accepted. Well, yes, Billah, see Allah's refuge and Allah's protection for that. Uh, Alhamdulillah, now that we are approaching end of this uh, 10 days, the these 10 days are the best days, according to the scholars. We have the 10 days of the first Zulhijjah, the month of Hajj. The first 10 days of the month of Hajj, they are also the best day in the world. They are the best day in the world because you find the Arafah in them. Eh, the Arafah is found in that, that, from that first 10 days. Also, the, the Nahar, where uh, people slaughtering doing the adhia, the adhia also uh, is found in that first ten days. They are good days because of their, their the daytime, the best days in the world in that first ten days of uh, of uh, of Hajj, the ten days of Hajj. They are the best days, but the Ramadan ones is they are the best nights. The nights are the best nights. Layali Ramadan, the night of the, the, the Ramadan. They are the best nights in the world. And then the, the, the days of Zulhijjah are the best days. So these are the, this is the, the difference between, uh, between the two. So inshallah, we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept our Ramadan. Also to uplift this pandemic that we are facing 
not only here but all over the world and Allah he knows best and all we need to pray that may Allah accept our prayer if Allah accept even one single of prayer one single of your of supplication wallahi you are the luckiest one you know so most importantly we are now deprived from praying jamaa in the masjid and Allah knows best Allah knows where and when he accept his servant supplication his servant prayers his servant dua we ask Allah to wa ta'ala to forgive our shortcomings and the little one we do our fasting the little prayers we do most importantly our faraid our composite prayers we shouldn't be joking with them this is the month you have to do what Allah asks you to do Allah said uh, and uh, the best thing my servant will do for me to be happy is what I ask him to do which is your five daily prayers your Ramadan fasting and you do it as you can and whatever extra comes up is something that take you more closer wala yazalu abdi yatakarrab ilayya bin nawafil the nawafil is the extras that you do allah said my servant take that closer to me so may allah help us to do more extras which will give us the best of this life and the best of hereafter aqulu qawli hadha wa astaghfirullah li wa lakum i pray for myself and for all brothers of all muslims all over the world may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala save us from this uh, uh, al bala from this uh, uh, virus from this uh, fitna tajruba from this test this is a test from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and inshallah the patient we become the best we become in the face of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala i pray that all of us see the end of the risk uh, at the end of this ramadan peacefully with health with acceptance from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wassalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh may allah bless you all ma salama